five. I realized that was very sudden, so I'm going to give everybody a few minutes to trickle in <clears throat> before we actually load in and get started. <clears throat> it just feels exceedingly dissatisfying to cut off halfway through Soul Forge and have to wait a week. And it turns out I'm home early today with a couple of hours to spare. And I think we can finish Soul Forge so that when this long gap that will be the next week comes into play, we will be able to um what word am I looking for? <laughs> we'll be able to uh start off with Thief Three, which makes a lot more sense to me. <coughs> Uh, hey, Lone Wonder. The throat's not 100%, but it's better than yesterday, which is about all I can hope for, I think. Hey, Karis. Good to have you here. Thanks for joining in on such short notice. I appreciate it. Yeah, well, it's it's kind of better. It's definitely not at 100% yet, but... Perhaps it'll get there. <clears throat> Considering we're going to have to wait a while, I suppose the hope is that it'll be better by the... Th it'll be 100% by the time we start Thief 3. That seems doable. <clears throat> Feeling spoiled. Yeah, I mean... I figured the anniversary was a good time to go revisit our origins, so to speak. Let's see, we've been live two minutes. I'm gonna give a, I'm gonna give it till the five minute mark before I actually start playing. Give people time to come in, because regardless of how long it takes this go round, I'm gonna stop when we finish Soul Forge, because like I said, the next we will probably not be streaming again until Sunday at the earliest, and that might be a good long one. Hopefully the voice will be completely better and we can kick it off with Thief 3. Oh. So, how is everyone's Monday? <clears throat> Fill me in, if you would. Still drinking hot tea, by the way. <coughs> the cold? It's April 15th. That's not supposed to happen. We're nearly a month into spring. What is this garbage? <laughs> hey, Martin. I'm sorry Monday didn't treat you well. <clears throat> Mine actually wasn't too bad. And Tiffany and I will be in attendance at the Avalanche game tonight. I've been to a few Avalanche playoff games before. And they've lost every single one I've attended in person. So I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that tonight we can turn that particular franchise around. <clears throat> Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's right. I forgot you're in the Southern Hemisphere. How silly of me. Yeah, I took a Mucinex. I've been drinking coffee and tea all day today. So, hopefully the voice holds up for the rest of Soul Forge, at least. Our first order of business is to get the last two secrets. And then we just go turn on the signal towers and we will be done. All right, we're up to six viewers. We've been waiting five minutes. Let's go ahead and load back in. Now the first order of business is to head to Bay B. 
That's true for both remaining secrets, if you're curious. Factory baby, here we go. It's the only one that we didn't use in the making of the guiding beacon. Instructions. Place source materials into basin on side of machine. Flip lever to activate machine. Products will emerge from tube. Okay. First thing is to use a flare mixture. Now where is this basin? Yeah, this one's a little annoying. So drop a flare mixture in the one. Drop an iron chassis in the other. And then hit the lever. Amalgamating machine. If I can find the lever anyway. Maybe it's on top. Yep. So there's secret number four out of five. Flare mixture and an iron chassis will make a flash mine. Um, well, yes and no, Martin. The If you were watching yesterday, there are a bunch of recipes in the plans room, and if you pick them up, they work correctly. The other secrets, though, no, there's no way to find them out. For the other, for the for the ones that give you credit for a secret, which are the flash mine and the flash bomb that we already made, and we're about to make an explosive device, that's the third, um, and of course the quote scroll, um, you have to just experiment and figure them out. Uh, I suppose that's why they give you secrets when you do, but... <clears throat> <clears throat> Now, the second, the last one is a little bit more complicated. We need to make a mine bulb, which we accomplish with an iron chassis and some quicklime mixture. So now that we have a, that, we'll have created a mine bulb. Oh, fuck me. Oh, shit, saw me. Shifting through the remnants of the Precursor's world, I found the tools the Builder had left for me. Why well, save these things when all else is gone? The Builder hath spoken to Karis, and imagine my joy when finally I did piece the puzzle together. How long did it wait for one such as me? One who could bring about the age when the Builder <sighs> would fall. I don't want to waste any resources dealing with this spider if I can help it. <clears throat> Again on Earth. Alright, so here's our mine bulb. Later, Potato. Hey, Tater, how's it going, man? Hey. Drinking on a Monday. I like it. Now, with a mine bulb we need to go to Bay D and use the sealing machine. <coughs> yes, Martin, you can disable the spider the same way you can um, a regular pod. I just didn't feel like it because I never have to go back there. And I'm low on water arrows. I only have nine. All right. <laughs> Hi, Tim. 
glad you are enjoying the thief as much as I am. Like I said, it just it felt dumb to leave off halfway through the last mission, so I'm just I'm trying to finish Soul Forge today. Then I won't really won't be able to stream again until at least Sunday, if not later. But we'll be in a good position to start Thief 3 that way. You cannot craft water arrows, no. Alright, so inside Bay D, we need to use the ceiling machine. We use the mine bulb and a bantam node. Which will get us the mission's final secret. <laughs> Once we make our way up here... We'll loop around, we'll hit the ceiling machine. And when we hit it, that should give us credit for the final secret. In the game! Ceiling machine. Oops. We did it incredibly. Crud. The reason it didn't work is because you have to put, and this is dumb, you have to put the bulb on the right and the node on the left. Otherwise it doesn't work. So excuse me. Node on the left bulb on the right. Now it should work. That's really fucking dumb. Oh well, all's well that ends well, right? I mean, assuming it ends well. There we go. Final secret. Okay. And with that, you're able to make explosive charges. All right, that is all of the secrets. We are ready to go to the northern apps and look for the signal towers. I think the safest way there is actually going to be <clears throat> back here, back through the fluid vapor interchange. We can get out that way. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, Martin, that's exactly what I was thinking. All right, we'll go back up here.
Hi, Alex. I am doing very well. How about yourself? Okay. Now, let's head to the Northern Apps. I believe this is it. Yes, Northern Apps to Upper Areas. So you can hear spiders. Ain't life grand. I'll take that water arrow gladly. Oh, fuck. That's gonna hurt. As is that. Come on, Garrett, make the jump, would ya? Fuckers are everywhere. Can we make that? I don't know. We might need to burn a... Might need to actually burn a vine arrow to do that. No, Martin, if you do an incorrect combination, it just... I believe, at least, it just spits your ingredients back out the other end. Yeah, that vine arrow we are going to have to abandon. That's fine, we have six more. <coughs> Long ago, I realized that heretics would never accept their roles in the coming of the Builder's Paradise. I anticipated thine acquisitions, Garrett, and others who would try to murder me. Thus, the Builder protects me. This chamber from which I speak, tis his arms encircling me. And all that I need is here within. I need not emerge until the Builder's paradise has come. And you are but dust blown upon the wind. Okay. So this is where we place our guiding beacon. We'll need that elevator to get back down easily. Signal slot B and signal slot A. So we've connected the guiding beacon to signal slot B. That indicates a signal tower. Roll on up. <clears throat> to tower number one. If Karis has any way to detect what I'm doing, I'll know soon. There's our first one. Now we want to head all the way back down to ground level. Come on. Harris didn't pipe up about the sabotage. Quickly pick this lock. You do have enough space to do it. And you get a nice shadow to duck into. Ain't life grand. <coughs> I 
<clears throat> a bantam node. Yay. Let's head down here. To what is clearly a basement area of sorts. Crud, crud. All right, good. Fewer patrollers is always better. This one I feel safe leaving here. Let's just wait for that robot to be gone. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. I'm going to nip over here to this elevator. Further down. Exploratory Inventing Workshop. Novices disallowed from entry. You can kill the lights here and pick up a flare, you know, if you're so inclined. And then, as is my want, I need to run and take a restroom break. Silly of me, I know. Be right back. Oh, wow. A dozen viewers on a Monday afternoon. It's pretty great. Onward. Don't quite want to go there yet. So now with the lights out, we can get under this camera. We can go even farther down, or for that matter, up.
Flux spheroid and spring wiring. That's what you can get out of there. Yay. Alright, so see all the metal plates on the floor? Obviously we want to avoid those. No reason to hoard moss arrows at this point. Let's go ahead and use one. <laughs> Just so we can take this chucklehead down. Alright, Tater. Cheers. Enjoy your Monday co-worker drinking. That sounds fun. There shouldn't be anything left in here that can actually hear me. All right, here's our second tower. Up, up, up we go. So once we're back down here, jump over to the other side of this machine. Be glad there's nothing around that can hear us. Now I believe that, yep, it opened. You can see it opened up these two big pressure doors. Let's go see what's back there. Mm, like, basically literally nothing. Okay. Yeah, nothing, just a room. But nothing inside. Oh, we explored it, goddammit! Alright. We actually want to duck into this water and swim. South first. And now to the east. And when we pop up here, 
There are a couple of water arrows. Ain't life grand. <coughs> Two more water arrows. Make that three. And we're back here. Let's see what's up here before we leave. A vine arrow. And an elevator. Oh, this is not the elevator we came down, I don't think. No. Spring wiring. Yay. All right. All right, here we go. Excuse me. Back up to here. Yay. Third tower's here. Call the lift down and wait. We'll grab a couple moss arrows while we're at it. That's three out of eight. Plotting dinner with Tiffany, just a second. Hmm. All right. That's it for down this ramp, so... Stay quiet, follow them, and it's super easy to get back to the ramp. <coughs> oh, excuse me. My goodness. Hmm.
Well, hey, buddy. This one's worth getting rid of. Watch that camera. There's a tower up there. We should be far enough away. Garrett, I must prepare thy soul for the builder's arrival. Plums thy thoughts and accept the words. Hey Luciano, how's it going? There's four towers. need to be wary of the camera. Get up onto these rafters. And cross the room this way. Stay careful. Can use another vine arrow here and pop into this big vent shaft. Hmm. We'll go east first. This is actually like a computer room. Trying to position things at the moment. Yeah, that didn't work. Fall. 
All right, here we go. Journals of Brother Kelsus. Karis hath given me warning that I might be called to Soulforge Cathedral for a short time during this next week, when all others hath been ordered to abandon it. Saith he that he would have need of me to operate the guiding beacon in the manner described in his message of some time ago. I was called directly to his chamber to receive these special instructions, and I noted to my horror that Karis hath begun to take on a metallic appearance. I know not what this pretends, but I shall certainly involve it in my conversations, should I opt to approach the other mechanists, in whom I have sensed the same doubt that I myself feel. <coughs> Karis clearly doth respect me as a skillful engineer, or else he would not have entrusted me with this duty. But I wonder how he would respond, if he sensed my growing inconstancy. But I need not ponder, as I can guess at the hideous misfortune he would dispense upon me. He hath truly forsaken his followers. But I remember not o'er long ago, when he was a hammer priest, rallying his peers round him for improvements in the order. It seems as though an eternity hath transpired since then. I think now of the days when I was a hammer, and how we put our faith in our tenets, and championed the builder and each other above all. I shall perform for Karis this duty he requires of me, but perhaps it shall be the last. My mind is resolved. I shall have conference with those friends that I suspect share my mind. Then there's a flash bomb in here. Actually, I think if you look over at the other side... <laughs> There's a little office over there, too. Yep, nope, we gotta make those jumps. Can't recover if we fall. Quicklime mixture in this one. Why is it hearing me? Alright, so you gotta hit that switch. <laughs> in here. Alright, once we've hit both of them...
we should be able to get to the next tower. Ah! Well, I was going to say relatively unscathed. I don't know what aggroed them, but it's not good. So the good news is... Um, I think we can get up the tower anyway. Here's Tower 5. Three more to go. <coughs> Excuse me. The scurry's about like a mouse. But there are 30 mansions too many to infiltrate in one night? You must spend your last hours of life. Tis equally dignified to laze in a field and await thy death. Should be able to sneak over to this door on the right to get out of here. Let's try and stay quiet as you cross back into this room. Gosh, excuse me. Continue to beware the camera in this room. And those spiders you hear patrolling around. We have a spider stuck here. Try and free it with quick loads, it's not gonna work. Hmm. I was say, let's really fuck him up, but that really fucked me up too. Maybe we can get them both. We can. It'd be better if I didn't die in the process. Yeah, fuck you. How do you like them apples? Double kill in a thief game. Let's hack them apart. I don't know if anything else comes through here. But let's keep it safe. I definitely hear one somewhere. Anyway. <laughs> oh shit, that thing. And don't sleep on the two frog eggs here. Oh, I aggroed something.
but it is fucking tracking me. It is on to me. Turret production. Oh lord, I remember this. <laughs> Yeah, hey. Let's make a save here. This one is going to be rough. Oof. So the turrets are just going to be active and firing the whole time we're in here. <coughs> Excuse me. Hustle. Hey! A fresh explosive charge. And fire arrows to boot. Well, that should help us fuck up those spiders on the way out if we have to. Sprint again! Hey, Nyron. That is good news. Glad to hear it. How are you, my friend? Key. I was going to say the key here is to stay in the sh stay in the shadows, ah! which I failed at, obviously. Maybe it's through here. Yes. My mistake. So that switch opens the tower gate. I didn't know they actually literally cheated. Run! Ah. Failure. Try again. Do better. Yikes. Was the baby that smote them, the precursors. He gave them the power to bring about his paradise. Oh, for fuck's sake. It was the baby that smote them, the precursors. He gave them the power to... I am still in perfect shadow. What is this shit? It was the baby that smote them, the precursors. He gave them the power to bring about his paradise. But they refused. Or locked the ingenuity. But the wall is coming. It is clear they were their failings. 
six out of eight. <laughs> yeah, Soul Forge is huge, Martin. Absolutely huge. Now, getting back out. Well, that's hardly fair. How the hell do I get up there fast enough? Alright. Fuck you very much. God damn. Boom! That was good. All right, two towers to go. <coughs> Zip past the fucking spider chapel. That was remarkably easy. All right. that thing. That was a fucking miracle. So that opened up that ground level room in the corner, if you were watching. <laughs> oh, fuck off. Damn it, no! You will make this drop without taking damage. Do you hear me? <clears throat> Fine, I'll fucking slow fall. I got two of them. So a bunch of building supplies, but the real prize for that high-risk situation is an invisibility potion. be a way back as well.
All right, we made it by. Fuck you, little fella. Fuck this thing. Gas mine. I have only been of the mechanist order for a short time, and already I like it muchly. Many of my friends have been hammers before, but some, like me, have been newly recruits. Afore I hath wanted longly to join a group of militant nature, so my skills in my not-so-dainty form could be put to good use. Alas, no such group would take me for long times, but the mechanists have been goodly to receive me thusly, and I owe them great thanks. They seem muchly impressed by mine skills at battle. Father Karras, our captain, hath ordered us to spend this week in the seminary. I think I hath understood that he needs the whole Soul Forge Church to himself to complete some sort of undertaking he worketh on. I shalt enjoy the seminary stay muchly, since it be so close to the many ta to many taverns that I mayst visit. I have found that the gentlemen find my mechanist livery quite fetching, and I receive more kindly attention than I am accustomed to. Oh, fuck. There is something in there that can hear me. Great, I guess we'll just have to time it. That is irksome, but it's alright. Broadheads. Alright, oh, that's actually isn't that bad. Okay. Flash bombs. Oh shit. We gotta pick this one. That is going to be a pain in the ass, apparently. Healing potion. Most excellent. Hey, and a slow fall. Awesome. Okay. Let's go say hey to the homes. <coughs> Here he is, the asshole himself. Art thou not a thief? Then steal thyself away, Pest. <laughs> yes, <laughs> hurry now and steal thyself away from this most holy place, ere the builder's children arrive again. This might be certain this time. There's absolutely no way into his room. Constantine, and I learned that. 
Yes, I know all about that past genes. Why else should I concern myself with the likes of me? No, he can't, Martin. It's the, um... We've read a lot about him engineering himself a completely impenetrable chamber and sealing himself inside it. All right, back down. Okay. Fresh frog egg. Here's tower number seven. <laughs> hey, Apotham, we're near the end now. We actually could go ahead and leave, but we like to explore, so we'll go find the eighth signal tower, too. This has been a fun little Monday afternoon diversion. While I wait on the hockey game. We can shut that behind us. And get rid of everything. Alright. I believe this is where the final tower is. because there are water arrows here. Should have known. It's pretty standard for, you know. Well, maybe I'm wrong. Huh. Nope, there aren't any water arrows. Oh well. Doesn't matter much. Let's hide over here, let him patrol the other way. Here's the eighth and final tower. <coughs> Which will just hit for giggles.
wait till it's patrolling away and go hit that button on the wall. I'll actually bring the bridge down to this end, which is pretty handy. As you can see. Stick to the shadows, avoid the camera. We can hide in these shadows and take down these last few mechanists if we want to. There's not really any need, but it's doable. <laughs> I think it's kind of a nice way to round things out. Now it's just a matter of sprinting out of here all the way back to the front doors where we came in. Oh, I think we actually have to go through that area where we saw those live patrols. We can kill if we want to. I should offer thanks to your departing trickster woman, for it was she that warned me. Before her arrival, I thought the city was blind to the builder's paradise I shall soon bring about. Yet tis just thee who knows. No matter, for even if all the city knew, still, I could not be stopped. Yep, get a frog egg on the way out. Now we'll cut back this way. And <coughs> we're back at the entrance to the North Apse. Head back here through the fluid vapor interchange. And now it's pretty much a straight shot out of here. And the game will be over. Fabulous, right? Okay, good. This will clear us up to start Thief 3 on my next long stream, which... I can't promise it'll be Sunday. I might be busy that day, but we'll have some weekly availability the following week if that doesn't end up working out. One last little fucking spider, apparently. Shh. 
to execute it in style. Or let it run like a bitch, you know, whatever it wants to do. <coughs> my goodness. So it seems my voice held up just long enough. Because we are out and done. Later, fuckers. All right, let's get our stats, and then the ending will play. Four out of four secrets. No loot, no pike pockets. Ending time. the master builder upon the ground and he saw that the ground was good and clean. No grasses marred his path, nay not a wisp of vilest weed did spoil his view. Let thy furnace be fueled, let thy buildings be sound, let thy foes be vanquished. And all thine endeavors be a blessing unto thee. Oh, what up, Karis? Didn't expect to see that, did you? Uh uh. was written. And there's more. Yes. Tell me. And that's it. That's your ending. All right, everybody. Thanks for tuning in for the end of Thief 2. I appreciate you showing up on short notice. We will be back at, like I said, Sunday at the earliest. It's unfortunate that it's that long, but it is what it is. And we will be kicking off Thief 3. Until then, thank you so much for tuning in. If you're live on Twitch and you enjoyed what you saw, I hope you'll hit the follow button so you can see every time we go live in the future. If you're watching later on on YouTube, I hope you will A, like the video, assuming you liked the content, of course, and B, subscribe to the channel. That way, despite the irregularity of my streaming hours, you can be sure that you won't miss anything. And finally, regardless of your platform, I hope you will join the Discord. The link to do so is in the Twitch channel description and or the YouTube video description. The Discord is where I make official channel announcements. It's where we discuss what you'd like to see me play. And we just have a fun community of people who love video games, same as you and me. Until next time, or Sunday at the earliest, enjoy this hiatus as best you can. Go Avalanche in all of their playoff games, and I will see you soon. Everyone take care.